Well, residents of a Waikiki apartment building say they never heard an alarm go off, even while flames engulfed a top floor unit. SKITV 4's Jill Kuramoto reports some fast action by a passing police officer may have helped save lives. Donna Lynch snapped these photos of the fire at 8.35 this morning, but she thinks she heard the smoke detector going off about an hour earlier. I heard it, and I looked around, and I sniffed, you know, and uh, there was no smoke, and I thought, this has to be somebody's um, alarm clock, but it didn't sound like it, but it didn't sound like a smoke detector either. This HPD patrol officer was driving by when he saw the fire and jumped into action. And I saw the cop screaming to get in, and I went ran downstairs and let him in, and he set off the alarm. By that time, it was, it was a full-blown fire. We're told he even tried to use the house line to put out the fire, but the flames proved too much. Although firefighters arrived on the scene within five minutes, this was one of the problems they found when they got here. Although fire officials say this wasn't a big problem in battling the fire. We directed companies to the Alawai hydrant, so we were over, able to overcome that water supply obstacle without any impact on the fire. A woman and her eight-year-old grandson live in Unit 803, but no one was home at the time of the fire. Damage was contained to the unit and no one was injured. But fire officials say a closer look into the alarm system at the Regency Apartments is planned to make sure it's working properly. Lynch says she sees this as a wake-up call. We should always pay attention. Be the one that calls, even if it's a false alarm, it could save somebody's life. Jill Kuramoto, KITV 4 News.